name is Carissa Lucille. I am the founder and owner of Wasted Ink Zine Distro. I typically tend to invite them to my distro so that they can see that in fact it's not dead and more and more people, variety of ages, are still making zines and reading and participating in print. Um, it's kind of interesting because the world of zines is kind of a large community, so I wouldn't say that I have business competitors um, because I'm not really in competition with anyone. Really the idea is to amplify voices, and so if there's another distro or other people making zines, it's a really good thing. Um, do you guys typically like, work together? We tend to work together. Um, I usually buy zines from other distros or send letters and just be in touch with all of them um, because, again, it, it's, it's, there's not really an, an air of competition in the zine world. It's more about just collaboration. I would say it's changing because, you know, a lot of people say, why would you make a zine? Why not just make a blog? Um, so the digital age definitely changed the way zines are made and maybe the purpose of zines. But in an era where we've all grown up on screens, I think zines step out of that world and they're more personable, they're more tangible, and therefore they feel a little bit more special. I don't know, do you read a blog? Do you read blogs? Okay, we got one. Okay, good. So um, I just think zines are kind of catching on again. You know, more and more people are interested, they're invested, they're making zines themselves. So I think it's coming back. Just the amount of zine fests I've seen pop up in the last few years has risen pretty drastically. I think people are getting more involved, and that's a really good thing.